Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how to use the There is an AI for that ChatGPT plugin, a plugin that you can use to find the right AI tools for any use case from one of the largest AI database. Right, so before I would show you an actual example on how to use the There is an AI for that ChatGPT plugin, let's see some of the use cases you can use this plugin for. So my website, rihex.com, I have full tutorial on this uh, ChatGPT plugin called There is an AI for that. In that article, I talk about some of the best use cases you can use this plugin for. So let's go over some of these use cases quickly. So as you can see, you can use that there's an AI for that ChatGPT plugin for startup research, academic research. So if you're a researcher studying the application of AI in various fields, you can use this plugin to find AI tools. You can use it for product development, competitor analysis. So if you're also developing AI tools, you can't find other competitors in your field. You can use it for investment research, consulting, career development, marketing, and so on and so forth. In this article, I also share some of the best ChatGPT prompts you can use this plugin with. So if you're interested in these prompts, make sure to check out this article. I will link it in the description below. And I also link a full database of all available ChatGPT plugins that you currently can use using the ChatGPT plugins model. It's an absolutely free database that you can also get access for free using the link in the description below. And in that database, I also include some of the best prompts and use cases you can use all of those ChatGPT plugins with. But now let's see an example on how to use the There's an AR for that ChatGPT plugin. Right, so before you would be able to use this plugin, there's a process you have to go through to be able to enable this uh, There's an AI for that ChatGPT plugin. So I'm not going to go over the complete process, but if you don't know any of these steps, which I'm going to go through quickly, you can check out my YouTube channel where there is a ton of tutorial on how to do these steps. So first you have to make sure that you are a ChatGPT Plus subscriber. Next you have to enable chat GPT plugins in your ChatGPT account. Then you have to click on new chat and make sure that GPT4 is selected from the model selector. Then from this drop down select plugins here. Then once plugin is selected, you have to click on this down arrow and make sure that the there's an AI for that plugin is installed. So it's installed for me. If you cannot see in this list, it means that it isn't installed for you. So you can click on plugin store and install this chat GPT plugin. Plugin. And last but not least, once the plugin is installed, you also have to enable the plugin. So you're going to be able to interact with this. Uh, there's an AI for that ChatGPT plugin. And you can enable a plugin by clicking on this checkbox next to the name of the plugin. Right, so let's see a quick example on how you can use this plugin. All right, so this is an example prompt I have copy pasted from my article. So if you want to get some other ChatGPT prompts for this, there is an AI for that plugin, you can find these prompts in the article. So in this example, we want the plugin to find AI tools that can help with customer behavior prediction in the e commerce industry. So let's click on execute. And ChatGPT will be clever enough to know that it has to use this. There is an AI for that ChatGPT plugin. And now it will fetch a ton of AI tools and software that can be used for customer behavior prediction in the e commerce industry. And as you can see, based on that information, ChatGPT will recommend us some. AI tools here. So Rosetta, Predict, Use Revelation, Hubble, Eclipse AI. And as you can see, you can click on all of these links and learn more about all of these AI tools and software. Right, so all you know, this is how to use the There is an AI for that ChatGPT plugin. If you want to learn more about this plugin, make sure to check out the article in the description below. And you can also get access using a link in the description below to the full database of all available ChatGPT plugins with the best use cases and the best prompts you can use those plugins with. And if you want to learn more about other ChatGPT plugins, make sure to check out our YouTube channel where I have a ton of tutorials on the best ChatGPT plugins with examples and use cases. So see you there.